First in tonight's news for your health, powered by HealthKey.com, there are many questions these days about the safety of vaccinations. With little ones heading back to school soon, parents will be bringing them in for their yearly checkups. A doctor at Penn State Hershey Medical Center says that is the perfect time to bring up your questions and concerns. The list of recommended vaccinations for children is a long one, and with all the controversies surrounding vaccines like fevers, autism, and seizures, parents have some choices to make. Vaccines, by and large, protect people from things that are unlikely events. Right? And it's unlikely that I'm going to get in a crash between here and my home, which is three and a half miles away. But I'm not willing to take the gamble of not wearing my seatbelt. It's important for mom and dad to be educated on the subject. Pediatrician Dr. Benjamin Levi says a child's yearly physical is actually the perfect time to bring up your questions and concerns. The decision, I believe, belongs to the parent about what's best for their child. Um, given all the things that are out there on the web and other places, I understand why parents worry. I mean, in my view, it's, it, it's parents' job to worry. That's what they're supposed to do. And it's my job and that of my colleagues to help people figure out what to worry about. Levi says he compares the decision to have your children vaccinated to the decision to wear a seatbelt. Both can come with risks. I'm sure that there are some people who die because they wear their seatbelts. They go into a lake, they can't get out of their seatbelt soon enough, and they drown. But in my mind, that's not a good reason not to wear seatbelts. And for a complete list of recommendations and vaccinations, you can go to our website, fox43.com.